More than 350 new condo units are coming to downtown Honolulu. And this project is part of a nationwide trend of converting urban office buildings into residential space. Casey Lenton live in downtown this morning with more on that. Casey? And good morning. And we're here at Modea. They're uh, kind of showing off what they've planned here at the uh, Pacific, Davies Pacific building. He's, we've been talking about uh, what's going to be built here in the timeline, pretty aggressive to uh, redevelop what's already built, this building, uh, by the end of 2025 or a holiday season in 2025. Uh, and so we've covered the essentials, but we want to kind of talk about the bigger picture. And I want to talk with Christine Camp, the CEO of Avalon, uh, to do that. Uh, you're really in envisioning making downtown a thriving community, correct? What is, uh, how does this Modea play a role in that vision? I think what it does is that it um, highlights all of the great things that's happening in downtown now. Um, downtown is going through a transition and now there's a big wave of new investments coming, not just from us, but from other investors. There, are, within the six block radius, we have over a billion and a half plus that's been invested in the last few years. And you're starting to see it in the community. Modea is starting, but you can see the Paris Bakery right around yeah. the block. And then you, you know, you're seeing the 88 Market. We're going to be doing the Walmart Community Center. The AC Hotel is open. This is all within walking distance, within a six block radius. And so it's an exciting time. Uh, when you, I, I liken to like when um, it, Kakako was starting, yeah. right? And Hokua started, and then the theater opened, and people couldn't quite un uh, grasp whether it was going to really make it. And look what it is now. It's yeah. a thriving city, and downtown is already thriving with yeah. people who are working here. But what we have is these gaps because we are transitioning from, um, you know, all, always in the office to working from wherever you are, right? Yeah. So these vacancies are now getting filled up with the new wave of investments and residents as they're coming in. And, you know, we spoke with Ben, your chief investment officer, about um, specifically what these, these units and what the amenities here, uh, the purposes they will serve, and you're going to be geared toward folks that are going to be working more hybrid, um, right. pet friendly. Tell me a little bit about what you're trying to create specifically uh, within this building. So just like you said, people, we recognize people work from home, uh, maybe pop into the office every once in a while. So we actually have offices as part yeah. of our amenities. So you have you, you know little offices with desks and everything that's for the residents here. They have um, phone booths where you can go into a phone booth and have a conference call. Uh, there's a recording studio or a karaoke so you can podcast yeah. um, and party rooms. And, and these are all areas that are going to be gathering places to create community or have privacy. And um, you know we kept in mind a lot of amenities, a lot of spaces that is useful to the residents without a lot of maintenance fees. Very good. Right? Uh, Christine Camp, I want to appreciate you out of time here, but we're going to keep you around and, and possibly talk a little bit more at 8 about uh, some of the other things that Modea is offering. Again, these units are uh, for sale uh, now in the office here, open from 10 a.m. to 6. That's right. Very good. Christine, thank you so much. We'll send things uh, back to Stephen Grace for now. Uh, thanks, Casey.